Are you ready to experience the power of the sun in a way like never before? Say hello to Concentrated Solar Power, or CSP, a revolutionary technology that harnesses the immense energy of the sun to produce clean, renewable electricity. With CSP, the possibilities are endless, from powering entire cities to driving industrial processes and beyond. Using mirrors or lenses to concentrate sunlight into a small area, CSP technology generates heat that can be converted into electricity, even after the sun sets. As the world races towards a sustainable future, CSP is quickly emerging as a game-changer in the renewable energy landscape, offering a reliable and scalable solution to our growing energy needs. So buckle up and get ready to bask in the brilliance of CSP, the ultimate fusion of innovation and sustainability. The world today is facing a pressing challenge of meeting the growing demand for energy while also addressing the issue of climate change caused by the burning of fossil fuels. Renewable energy sources like solar, wind, hydro, and geothermal energy are seen as potential solutions to this problem. Among these, solar energy is perhaps the most abundant and readily available source of renewable energy. However, the challenge has been to develop efficient and cost-effective ways of harnessing solar energy. Concentrated solar power is one such technology that has emerged as a viable solution to this challenge. In this essay, we will explore the concept of CSP, how it works, and its potential as a source of renewable energy. What is Concentrated Solar Power, or CSP? CSP is a technology that harnesses the power of the sun to produce electricity. It works by concentrating sunlight onto a small area using mirrors or lenses creating intense heat that can be used to generate electricity. CSP plants typically consist of large arrays of mirrors or lenses that focus sunlight onto a central receiver, where the heat is collected and used to generate steam, which in turn drives a turbine to produce electricity. The technology has been in use since the 1980s, but recent advancements in CSP technology have made it more efficient and cost-effective. How does CSP work? The basic components of a CSP system include a solar field, a thermal energy storage system, a power block, and a cooling system. The solar field consists of mirrors or lenses that concentrate sunlight onto a receiver. The receiver is a device that absorbs the concentrated sunlight and converts it into heat. The heat is then transferred to a fluid, which is used to generate steam that drives a turbine to produce electricity. The thermal energy storage system is an essential component of CSP technology. It allows energy to be stored and used when the sun is not shining. This is done by using a heat transfer fluid to store the excess heat generated during the day in a thermal energy storage system, which can be used to generate electricity at night or during periods of low sunlight. The power block is a part of the system that converts the heat generated by the receiver into electricity. It consists of a turbine, a generator, and other associated equipment. The cooling system is used to remove excess heat from the system and prevent damage to the equipment. Advantages of CSP One of the main advantages of CSP technology is its ability to generate electricity on a large scale. CSP plants can range from a few megawatts to hundreds of megawatts in size and can power entire cities or even entire countries. This makes CSP a viable alternative to fossil fuels for meeting the growing demand for energy. Another advantage of CSP is its ability to store thermal energy, which allows electricity to be generated even when the sun is not shining. This makes CSP a reliable and predictable source of energy, unlike other renewable energy sources like wind and solar PV that are dependent on weather conditions. CSP also has a low environmental impact compared to fossil fuels. It produces no emissions of greenhouse gases or other pollutants, making it a clean and sustainable source of energy. Additionally, CSP plants can be built in remote areas where there is no grid connection, providing electricity to off-grid communities and reducing their dependence on fossil fuels. Challenges Facing CSP Despite its many advantages, there are also challenges facing CSP technology. One of the main challenges is the high upfront cost of building CSP plants. CSP plants require a large amount of infrastructure and specialized equipment making them more expensive to build than other renewable energy sources like wind and solar PV. Another challenge is the need for large amounts of water for cooling. CSP plants use a lot of water for cooling, which can be a problem in arid regions where water is scarce. However, 
new cooling technologies that use less water are being developed and implemented to address this challenge. Another challenge facing CSP technology is its dependence on sunlight. While CSP technology can store thermal energy to generate electricity when the sun is not shining, it still relies on sunlight to generate the heat needed to produce electricity. This means that CSP is not a 24-7 source of energy like fossil fuels, and it may not be able to meet the peak energy demands of some regions. Finally, the land use requirements of CSP plants can be a challenge. CSP plants require large areas of land to be set aside for the solar field and other infrastructure. This can be a challenge in areas where land is scarce and where there are competing land uses. Potential for CSP Despite the challenges facing CSP technology, its potential as a source of renewable energy is significant. According to the International Energy Agency, CSP could provide up to 11% of global electricity generation by 2050. This would require the installation of approximately 900 gigawatts of CSP capacity worldwide, up from just 7 gigawatts in 2019. CSP has the potential to play a key role in meeting the growing demand for energy while reducing greenhouse gas emissions and combating climate change. CSP plants can be built in regions with high solar irradiation, including deserts and other arid regions. This would help to reduce the dependence on fossil fuels in these regions and promote the development of renewable energy industries. In addition, CSP technology can be used to drive industrial processes that require high temperature heat, such as cement production and chemical processing. This could further reduce greenhouse gas emissions and promote sustainable industrial development. To unlock the full potential of CSP technology, further research and development are needed to address the challenges facing this technology. Governments and industry leaders should continue to invest in CSP research, development, and deployment to drive down costs, improve efficiency, and overcome technical and operational challenges. One promising area of CSP research is the use of advanced materials for solar absorbers and heat transfer fluids. New materials can improve the efficiency of CSP systems and make them more cost-effective. In addition, research is also being conducted to develop new storage technologies for CSP including the use of molten salt and other high-temperature materials. Another area of focus for CSP research is the development of new storage designs that can improve efficiency and reduce costs. This includes the use of new mirror designs, tracking systems, and thermal storage technologies. Advances in automation and control systems can also improve the performance and reliability of CSP systems. Finally, governments and industry leaders must work to overcome regulatory and policy barriers to the deployment of CSP. This includes streamlining regulatory processes and providing incentives for the deployment of CSP systems, such as tax credits and feed-in tariffs. Policymakers should also work to develop energy markets that value the benefits of CSP, such as its ability to provide peak energy and grid stability. Concentrated solar power is a technology that harnesses the power of the sun to produce electricity. It works by concentrating sunlight onto a small area using mirrors or lenses, creating intense heat that can be used to generate electricity. CSP has many advantages, including its ability to generate electricity on a large scale, store thermal energy, and produce no greenhouse gas emissions. However, there are also challenges facing CSP, including its high upfront cost, dependence on sunlight, and land use requirements. Despite these challenges, CSP has significant potential as a source of renewable energy. It can help to meet the growing demand for energy while reducing greenhouse gas emissions and promoting sustainable development. As the world continues to move towards a sustainable future, concentrated solar power is a technology that will undoubtedly play a key role in achieving this goal.